you will recall last night we beat like a bajillion bosses in this game uh we got that move that i just showed you there which is also this move it can like let you go any direction in the air and it can let you do this this charge thing that while in combat actually consumes one of your bullets it's not a bullet it's actually it's got its own name it's got its own name it's called a alchemical resist no that's not it it's an alchemical vial of some sort i don't i don't know i don't know but it's the ammunition uh, and and basically 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 it consumes those so it's kind of a pricey endeavor but if i save it for bosses it'll be fine we came to a new area now i'm gonna check really what it's called i think it's called the, the city yeah we are here we're in the city and this is like it's time to game basically it's time to game we're gonna be upgrading our weapon more if we can today it's already rank level three we're gonna go for rank four i think that i just need 5k then i can upgrade it again i should check quickly before i head out i'll just check in the carriage over here but yeah like overall i've actually been enjoying this game i mean i thought i would yeah i just need 5k then i can do it i thought i would yeah <laughs> Dude, my character's face in all the screens. I don't know. My character's got a funny look to her. I think I made a good-looking character considering what was available. But, like, at the same time... You know... Well, shit. That guy schooled me. That doesn't heal me a lot. I mean, they keep saying it heals a lot, it heals a lot, it heals a lot. It doesn't heal a lot. It just heals, like, a, a tiny amount. Okay, so there are actually also a bunch of different areas now where we can go back and and sort of reassess. Like, because they are they are basically we've got this this new move now, this thing, and it can it can allow us to. That's weird. It can allow us to basically uh, traverse areas we couldn't traverse before, and uh, it, it's woo, it's something that I'm not gonna look at doing right now, but he just self destructed. But as I come across these areas, and as I maybe have to go back to the older areas, I will have a look and see if I can find any new places to go. Uh, I remember seeing a guy standing sniping, because we, we ran in here last night. There was a guy on one of the rooftops, and I was going to be annoyed by him. I was almost certain. I was like, yeah, that guy's going to be annoying. Because of that one time I found something in a barrel, I think I have to break all the barrels. It's an absolute waste of time. What do I like in the game too, based on what I played so far? It's it's actually very funnily enough. It is it is like slap bang in the middle of Greedfall and Dark Souls. It's it's crazy. But like okay, when I say Dark Souls, I mean Dark Souls, Bloodborne, Sekiro, Elden Ring, the entire list of them. It's like it they've taken all the inspiration, not the content, the inspiration from those, and they've just mixed it up with Greedfall and. I mean, I think that's kind of great, because what ends up happening then is that they, as developers, get to stick to what is essentially their comfort zone, because, you know, they made a game, and it was pretty okay, greedful, and they also, at the same time, get to broaden their horizons a little bit, and, and sort of try something different. I think, I think they did a great thing, like, I mean, it's, it's a smart move. Like, they are making Greedfall 2, and that's going to be its own thing. Uh, it's going to be like, that's, you know, that's Greedfall 2. It's going to be another Greedfall game. It's not going to be a Souls-like, it's an RPG, which is more akin to, like, Dragon Age, I guess you could say, or Mass Effect. Uh, but, like, yeah, I, I think that it, it's definitely, like, just straight up a mix of those two. And, I mean, they didn't really perfect the combat, but they, in my opinion gave it a worthy shot and it, it like it works well enough to be fun enough for me to want to spend time in it are you serious about this oh there's the guy on the roof i see him okay let's just go for this guy quickly i mean like the problem i have with the combat in this is like while while it is good and i think that a lot of it makes basically greedful seem a little boring uh, it, it isn't as responsive and sort of easy to pick up and play as Dark Souls or Elden Ring or whatever. 
Um, and that, I think, comes with polish. The chances are, if you had to play this game in, in six months, it would be a far different experience. Uh, and, and most likely a far better experience. I think that they, they did some things, like, really right. Like, the, the dodge mechanic in this, at first I thought it's very sluggish. But when you get the hang of it, 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 it feels way better than it did at first because you just have to basically get the timing right and then it's super 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 quick like you move so fast and you can like circle around enemies and it doesn't take too much of your stamina to make it like uh, you know cumbersome to use or anything like that i don't know i don't know a lot of it's it's, it's pretty good like honestly a lot of it's pretty good hey oh well that's unfortunate Well, that might be a problem. Ah, it's just the one guy. We're fine. He's gonna do it again. That move always sucks for him. Like, I don't know why he even does it, man. There we go. Okay, one more guy. You shooting at me? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't lock onto the dogs. Oh, did I just... I just bet I just pulled the dogs. Yeah, I did. <laughs> oh, no. Shit. It was just one dog. That's fine. I'm running out of stamina here. That's the frost. Whoa! Yeah, dude. That's the that's the frost charge thing. It's so good, man. Oh, it's so good. I'm gonna see if I can not use a potion and then maybe get to two finishing blows, and replenish my health with just that. There are so many barrels here. God damn. I don't think there's anything in any of these. I'm just gonna assume there's nothing. So this area is a cluttered mess, man. Oof, 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 oof. Let's go up here clear and see if there's anything. Nope. Nope. It's a cluttered mess and my FPS sort of agrees with that. 100% dude, my FPS is struggling. I'm gonna run all the way around quickly. So how do I even get up there? This is crazy, I want that. I can't just leave an item. God, do I have to come all the way around this way again? I think I have to. Wait. Where is the way through? Is it here? I swear it was back here, right? Where the heck? How did I do it earlier? On this side? Oh, it was it was over here, right? Yeah, this is this is a way up. Oh my god, I'm over. Uh, hoop, hoop. There we go. And then the item is. Where the hell is the item? Oh, it's over there. Is that? No, that's not from the guy I killed. He was just protecting this item. Frost grenades. Yeah. Oh god. Well, here we go. I'm going to check the compass quickly just to make sure we're not lost. So, that's not the one we're looking for. We're looking for that one. It's just 38 meters. It's like right there. Alright. So. The plan is the plan. We can go across there. It doesn't seem to go anywhere. We can go down here. Doesn't seem to go anywhere either. Let's check in this area. Nothing, nothing. I can't remember where we came from. I think it's down here is where we... No, we didn't come from there. We came from that side then. Or that side. Yeah, we came from there. Yeah, because I hear dudes on this side. Okay, we're going to go this way first. We'll kill this dude over here. And then we'll jump over. Oof, Yeah, dude. Did I get a heal from that? I feel like I always look and my health seems like it doesn't go up. Are you serious? Okay, oh god, the camera spinned again. Uh, there's probably a way to open this gate, but most likely on the other side. Yeah. Alright. 
All right. I guess that is that then. Oh, I see. So this is actually just, it's been made for people that don't have this air dash. Because obviously you can come here first. Like, as far as I understand, I chose to go where I went uh, as my first destination. Also, wait, I haven't been down here. This isn't where I came from, is it? Uh-uh, it's not. Okay, so there's a lot of different ways to go. I wonder if I can backstab this guy. Chances are not, because there's probably some other dudes around here somewhere. But I'm gonna try. Hell yes, dude. That's insane damage. Oh, God. Yo, guys. Wait, did I actually just do that? Oh my god. I had him right where I wanted him and then I didn't finish the job. Alright. So we are already at 5k. We can go and upgrade our... Uh... Oh, there it is! Oh, but if I do rest then... Oh, that's just fire. If I do rest then uh, I will unfortunately reset the mobs. So I'm not going to rest right now. This place looks great. There's probably people in here. Hold on. Nope. Nope. Ain't no people here. I knew it. I knew it, dude. These stupid snake ladies. They're always hiding somewhere in the shadows. Let it be known that I knew. Dogs barking. Hello? Hmm. I feel like... <laughs> that would have been so cool. That would have been so cool. Oh, the lever's on that side. Okay, so it's an approach from that side. There is an area up above here. Ooh, shit, dude. There, here. Okay, I see it. I see it. I see it. We spider monkeys now. Let's go. This game's running and jumping sucks so much balls that the platforming sections really end up being like super arduous. It's like really hard work, man. Oh, cutscene. Fantastic. Hey, Tufty fella, what up, yo? This is what I came for, right? Is that the queen? Man, I look cool. Where did he come from? Stop. Not another step or I shoot. Wait. I have come on behalf of the Marquis de Lafayette. He's taken an automat for his aide de camp. You're no more human than the machines that laid waste to this city. I was not given the same orders as the others, monsieur. Just what mission has the Marquis entrusted you with? I must hmm. meet with Abbe Grégoire. Alas, you've come too late. The abbot has got it into his head to go to the Palais de Justice. He is certain that Monseigneur de la Far, the Bishop of Nancy, is being held prisoner by the monstrosity that is wreaking havoc on the Ile de la Cité. Huh. How can he possibly hope to free him? The abbot is a holy man. He would lay down his life to right an injustice. But there isn't one among us who stands the slightest chance against that thing. Not the slightest chance. Me! The Palais de Justice. The Palace of Justice. This place sort of very much looks like the area that Blood Hunt is in. Vampire the Masquerade, Blood Hunt, the, the Battle Royale. But I know for a fact that that's Prague or something, right? It's It's not like... It's not quite the same uh it's just it looks like a lot of the the buildings and it looks like a lot of the uh, the big like churchy chapel -y type things look almost identical you're on the last half of the final book of the first lord trilogy and would you recommend that trilogy to me silver would you say to me hey it's a good read because i mean you recommended the 
Robin Hobb books. And I must tell you, like, I, I'm, I'm glad to have read it. I'm almost done. I'm like five minutes left in the book. I didn't have time to read or listen. You're not going to do any more immediately. Well, then I don't know what I should be listening to. Okay, so we have some way to go now. Let's see. Hmm. I mean, I could maybe I should try Brandon Sanderson. I've had some people tell me that he's pretty good. Maybe I should try his workout. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He sounds like he could be a breath of fresh air in my life. Perhaps that's a great idea. Hmm, yeah. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Mm hmm. Jesus, guy. Well, that's something. Why do all these fire guys have to do that? It's no fun when they self-destruct on me. But yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm going to look. I've got a long list. Maybe I'll try the murder bot novels. I don't know. Those were recommended to me a long time ago, and I still haven't gone through with it. Hmm. Okay. Well, Mistborn is a great place to start for Brando Sando, and I think that uh, you are making the right choice. However, Mistborn is quite a long series. Oh God, a series as well, right? Uh, so Mistborn, it has the it has the different, let's just say like phases. Uh, the the they have different like. Well, it's different trilogies basically. The first trilogy of Mistborn is uh, one set of characters, and the next one is a different set of characters with lots and lots of different extras uh, well it's like it's all the, it's all the same it's all connected and it'll feel very connected it's just different but yeah like i think i think mistborn is good if you go for mistborn you can actually read the first three um and you can do the first three and then you can see how you like it and uh, if you want to change your pace you can start on the stormlight stuff with that jesus not with it but like after it Okay, let's see. Let's pick up the stuff over here. I need to actually go and and rest at the carriage and change my weapons and stuff, upgrade them. But I don't really want to leave my progress here. There's got to be a vestal here somewhere. That's your plan? Uh, well, look. Okay, so, like, if I had to say right now, there's a vestal through there. I, I personally think that Stormlight has a much more epic feel to it. And I personally think that Stormlight Archives overall is is my preferred series. But all the stuff that I've read from his, I can't wait for more. I can't wait for the next Mistborn book. I absolutely can't wait for the next uh, Alcatraz and the Evil Librarians book. And that's like a kid's book, dude. And I love it. It was so fun. Uh, and then I, I obviously can't wait for the next Stormlight book. Uh, and they will come in, obviously, and and probably kind of soon, uh, but yeah. It's still a bit away, obviously. Come on, guy. The heck is that? That was easy enough. Oh, no, yeah, I, pr I prefer Mistborn. I think Mistborn is the best place to start. Because Mistborn is actually so out of the ordinary. It it's like, look. And he says this constantly. That was stupid. He says this constantly in, like, interviews and stuff. Um, Mistborn is, it's very different from other, like, fantasy novels that are out there right now, uh, in its setting, basically, and, and in the way the story is told and stuff, I mean, the okay, not the way the story is told, but in the setting, and it's, it's, it's like, it's like the anti-Lord of the Rings, basically, <laughs> uh, and, and I think that premise enough is a good reason to start on that, because it's a pretty exciting beginning, uh, and, and, like, I would, I would, obviously recommend that in a heartbeat just because of that and i think that on top of it it is slightly less dense and it's a, a slightly easier read than the stormlight stuff stormlight stuff it, it, it starts a little 
a little slow. And then it has so many like ups and downs in, in good ways. I mean like with action and then with, with calm and action calm, action calm. And uh, he usually has at the end of his books what they call a sander launch. Where, where he has like an avalanche of like ho holy shit crazy stuff happening and you think oh my god that's the big twist and then like three seconds later you're like ah oh, shit how could i not have seen this coming this is the big twist and then it just keeps going like that yo tape what up uh, and i think that mistborn uh, it, it gives you the right idea about his writing right from the start which is amazing so you, you can sort of you can sort of let's just say make up your mind pretty easily with mistborn i'd say this is a regular old doggy Oh, and, well, okay, that's the suicide doggy. Dude, I can't stand these things. Tape, how's it going, man? How's the Death Knight leveling going, man? I do that every time, dude. Every damn time. Every damn time. Okay, we got him. You agree? Peblos agrees. There you go. Yeah, and listen, I've read enough of the Sanderson books now to know. But I will also say, do not, do not rule out the kids' books. Because, <laughs> like, I really enjoyed the Alcatraz and the Evil Librarians books. It's silly, dude. It's kind of silly in a good way. It's very light reading compared to all the other Sanders and stuff. And I think that because of the way it's set up, because of the way it's set up, I feel like you can read all the serious Sanderson stuff, and then you take a little vacay in in uh, Alcatraz, <laughs> and and it'll be so fun. Like I, I I heartily recommend that. And yeah, the twists at the end of 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 Mistborn are like second to none. Like I I I, I was just left like, what what the hell, man? I, I couldn't I couldn't, dude. Yeah. I know how OPDK was. I know. And did you see that they're offering a mount now? I mean, I know you saw that. You must obviously have seen it. You see everything. They're offering a mount now to level Death Knights. I think that's good. I think it's fine. Like, whatever, man. Because if you've got a WoW sub, you got a WoW sub. If you're playing WoW, you're playing WoW, man. Uh, cool, cool, cool. I'm making a mistake here, but hey. Here's to making mistakes. Let's just keep going. I know there's, yeah, I was about to say, I know there's more of them down here. It has to be the fire guys, like, every damn time, huh? It's just doing the DK starting area? Oh. Okay, and is it in the game right now? I'll tell Eileen, she's gonna be ecstatic about that. God damn, dude. I just want to kill that guy. Is that too much to ask? And now they're killing him. <laughs> Suck it. Yes! Dodged. That's all you gotta do? Okay. Well, there you go. I'll tell her. Amazing, dude. Amazing. Very generous. Yeah, I, I actually... I actually um, I read an interview with Brandon Sanderson about Mistborn. Uh, and as far as I understand, the twist at the end of the first book was actually meant for like a different point in the story altogether and like he, he wasn't planning on doing that uh, it was like he he, he he sort of did the book and I'm, I'm not 100% sure on this but it, it's something like he did the book and then the people who who read it for him and his editor and everyone said you know it's good but I felt like the ending left a little to be desired. It wasn't really punchy. And then he added this 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 new twist to the end, and they were like, "Oh my God, that's the best book I've ever read." Uh, it like it flipped everyone's opinion entirely. Uh, so it's like he had this ace up his sleeve, and he was like, "I don't know. I guess he was hesitant about it." I don't know. I can't go through here. Hey, dude. Hey, there's so much stuff in this game. These levels are, as I said before. So goddamn dense. Ah, oh, shit! Dude, this game and its stupid jump scares. <sighs> oh, we get in somewhere. This looks like a boss battle arena right here. Mm-hmm. 
Perhaps not. I see you over there, guy. See, I've actually figured a trick out uh, with the with the bat with the critical hit finisher, right? If you line it up so there's like a mob on the other side there, and then you do this, then you can actually hit two of them with that critical damage. This is not a bar of ballerina. I thought this was an open area down here, but it's actually a river. Cool. <gasps> that's the bridge. That's that. That's that well-known bridge from what was it? Like the th was it from Thief or from Dishonored? What game was it from? Where they had that bridge, and you crossed out. Oh my God! It's famous, dude. It's famous. It's cursed that you listen to Final Fantasy XIV music while leveling in TBC. That's kind of cursed, dude. Uh, maximum slap in the faceage. Uh, we can, haven't been there. But, but, yeah. Was it from Thief? I loved that level, dude. I thought it was fantastic. I always just want opportunities to listen to music while gaming, dude. Because sometimes music... Oh, oh, it's a Vestal, finally, dude. I think this is a memory. Here we go, here we go. It might be Dishonored also? Yeah, it's possible. Oh, shit. What is that? It's a, probably a big memory. Oh, Tim! You. You were made of neither flesh nor blood. You were an automat like those who committed this massacre. I have received no such command. I am carrying out a mission on the orders of the Queen. Your friend on Place Saint-Marie informed me of your intentions. Alas. I was not able to reach the Palais de Justice. I fear that the soul of Monseigneur de Lafarre is lost forever. Was he killed? What has been done to him is a fate worse than death. Oh, shit. Same as me then. There were so many bodies, so many innocents strewn about the square, the air there. There was something sinister about it. I felt it poisoning me, body and soul. As for getting back to the Société, it's hopeless. The streets are teeming with machines, but the machine that is wreaking havoc in the area around the Palais is colossal. Much, much larger than yourself. What's more, the soul of His Excellency the Bishop has been imprisoned within this monster. What is this now? I'm certain of it. Have you seen the flames coming? The soul has been imprisoned. I don't think any See, it's like us. I'm pretty certain we are also like someone's daughter. I'm just not sure if we are the, uh, the machinist's daughter or what. I, Henri de la Far, Bishop of Nancy, ask the Lord to bless this assembly. And watch over this meeting of the estate's general. God, there goes my FPS. <clears throat> it was 30 FPS for a second there. Let us not turn a blind eye to the misfortunes of a populace who is condemned to the most abject poverty. For there is no greater sin than to ignore the suffering of one's brethren. Mm -hmm. Say the thing. The wickedness of the court is an insult to the misery that reigns in our lands. Hmm. Is that the thing? In such dark times, how can one conceive? Are we going to be standing in the rafters now? Play shepherdess or tinker with clockwork contraptions. Okay, slander then. He goes the route of slander. Mon Dieu, what happened? You stopped moving. I feared you were broken. I do not know. I only touched this ring. Monseigneur de la Farce ring. Oh, do this son. Oh, shit. Whoever you are, help him, please. Lord, let not that his soul be forever lost. Make haste. I beg of you. Man, this game looks really nice. Even on normal graphics, it looks really nice. Okay, so... Oh, okay. So, well, there it is. The uh, the whole place just blew open. <laughs> what the hell? Before I sit down here... No, see, I came over there. It definitely doesn't matter if I sit down. 
Or does it? Hold on, let's just go check up here. Oh! Yeah! Right, my tweet of Lillian sitting under the black box. Right, yeah, no, she didn't have a tantrum or anything like that. She didn't, it was nothing along those lines. No, no, no. Uh, I, I should actually just tweet that and explain the situation. She actually just went and sat uh, in her room. I closed the door. Oh, uh, well, my mom, the mom closed the door. Helene closed the door. She said, I want to go in my room. You can close the door and I'll play, she said. And, and we thought, okay, she's definitely going to nap. Uh, and then we were like, okay, you should nap if you want to. And then she was like, yeah, yeah, whatever, close the door. And then we closed the door and we left her. I went for a walk with Nero quickly, and mom was here. Uh, and then I came back, and then Eileen was sleeping, and, and I, I, I just heard Lillian yak, 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 yak. Then eventually she called mom, and I went in there, and she was under the box, and, and the room looked like that. Uh, so she played hard. Like, she played hard. For sure. It was very good. It was a good play. Okay, we upgrading our weapon again. This is nice. Oh my god. Oh my god, wait, does this mean that we get S rank of agility uh, affinity in the next one? Yeah, in the next one. Oh my god, this is a massive upgrade, this next one. It's huge. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, I can upgrade this one if I want, but I don't use it anymore, so... That's pretty cool. We have two module keys. We need to spread our love a little bit, so I need one more module key so I can do that. Uh, which means if I can buy a module key in the boutique, I should get it. There we go. Bronze, bismuth, and cast iron here. We don't have the orichalcum yet, which we need. Uh, so for the modules... Nap feels like wasted time. You'll nap when you're dead. Yeah, well, for, see, the thing is, for her... Even though she handled herself pretty well, when she doesn't sleep, she's cranky, she's angry, she's a bit of a, like, she's a bit of a menace, you know? Uh, she needs her rest to be her best, okay? And uh, she, she, she really, like, if she doesn't sleep well at night, she really wakes up cranky, and then it just gets worse as the day goes on. She doesn't nap throughout the week anymore, but sometimes on weekends she does. And this morning, uh, we, we got home already at 11 o'clock from school, so um, we had a, a little bit of a slightly longer day, and we recommended a nap. And we usually do over the weekend as well, uh, but she did not take the bait, so. Anyway, uh, I'm going to check quickly, boutique one more time, modules. I'm just going to check what there is. Balance, will to live, uh, no. Okay, so now we have 1.8k left. I'm going to spend that on items and I'm going to put some modules in quickly. So Avarice is nice, but for the most part it's less important. Stable charging, that's balance during attacks. Uh, I don't use charge attacks. Efficient charging, fully charged attack, no. Fulmination, no. The Grade 2 Longevity is super nice. Uh, we've got that one equipped already. Will to Live. We'll put the extra health in. So we got two extra health ones in. Sorry, I'm just doing a bit of like, basically a bit of... Uh, set up stuff here so that the next part of our run is going to be smooth. Now we have a lot of health, and that's cool. People keep infecting the quest NPCs of the plague. <laughs> oh, good. <laughs> I know it's annoying, but like, I'm glad that people are getting to experience that. That's all I'll say. It's just like, okay, we need to go boutique. Let's buy, I, I, th I think it's just good that they're experiencing it, you know? It's a rite of passage, man. Okay, so these are here. Alchemical capsules. Let's get 10 of those. Get 10 of those. We're good to go. Okay. I enjoy using these, uh, these heal over time pots. I want to go over there, but like, how do you even get there? Yeah, no, the original was like really, 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 really bad, of course, and they would have toned it down a bit because they want people to still play the game. They don't want people to like peace out and say, yo, I'll come back when the plague's over. Uh, it, it's fine. And it's funny, by the way, that they made this into, like, this massive event, uh, where it was really not meant to be. 
Uh, but, but hey, man. Oh, I didn't come through here. If people are enjoying it, then people are enjoying it. How the heck am I supposed to get over there? I cannot make that jump. It's fine. It's probably not anything important anyway. Did I have, I... have I gone through here? No. I'm trying to decide if I need to kill this guy quickly. Come through this side. Yeah, we did come through this part, didn't we? I sort of seem to remember this. But I, I'm not 100%. Let's just check quickly. Okay, yeah, I'm, I'm not going to go back this way now. It's fine. But I, again, I will say that I'm super glad that people are enjoying Wrath because uh, I think that that if you're going to spend time in a classic game, let it at least be a game where there's a lot of stuff to do. And Wrath, I think it, it definitely ticks all the boxes where that's concerned. Uh, so, yeah, like, good Thank on them. You, my dear. You're not like the others, are you? You gave them quite a beating. What's this? Madame. Why didn't you come sooner, my share? Those poor children in the National Guard. They could have used your help. They marched all day on the Pont Neuf. Oh, you should have heard them singing as they marched on the Place Dauphine. They were very brave then. To hear them, you'd think that the king had already handed over his crown. Then what happened? As far as I know, gunfire, the booming of cannons, Shouting. Lots of shouting. And then... Silence. You infect everyone as an act of revenge? Of course, I mean... None it's what you do. None of the soldiers returned. It's what you do. No. Not a single one. My son. My little Francois. He left this morning to join the volunteers. But he hasn't given any sign of life since. I'll try to find out what happened to him. Ah, it's a side quest. Okay. Let's go. Oh, shit. I thought we'd go straight across, but it looks like... Hey. I've given up on asking for weapons, so just give me some armor. Oh. Oh. I'm going straight back to do that. What the hell? It's right there. That's increasing the amount the potions heal, I think. Yeah. Okay. That's lucky. Very good. Oh shit, we're on the... Okay, here we go, we're on the shore now. Oh god. How did that hit me, man? I didn't need to use it twice. Oh, dude, it's always these stupid snake ladies. Totally worth it. Gimme, give gimme. Give Unstable essence. What is that? Can I walk here? No, no, no. I'm not going to take the chance. Dude, dude. I realized that they might be trying to show me that this is shallow here. No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> but I'm not going to take that bait, dude. Ain't no way. Ain't no how. He's in a corner. No, it's another guy. Oh, they just killed each other. <laughs> well, sort of. Okay, good shit. We're already on 2,000. I just spent all my souls and I'm already on 2,000. 
That's pretty good. It's going up super fast. I say like the level design in this, they they actually expect that you pay attention a little bit. I mean like they they definitely don't like hold your hand. Some of these areas you don't just see. I guess they sort of train you throughout the game uh, to to be a little bit more observant and also to to watch the verticality. But like still, man, still. So where's this boss, man? Like. Oh, it's him. Oh, here we go. <laughs> that's his head. I can see that's a human's head on a uh, on a mechanical body. Oh, God. Okay, this is going to be grim. I'm down. I dig it. I dig it. We're going to one-shot this guy, too. Because that's what we do. I wonder if I can use my gun on him. I can. Oh my god, that makes it so easy though. It's frozen. Oh shit. See, he didn't really do damage there. I got him. He's dead. Okay, so, uh, you know what? I think I'm over leveled. <laughs> oh, shit. I, I think I'm over leveled. I that was a bad dodge, but, like, I think I'm over leveled. Uh, it's like, it just seems to me. Yeah, I'm definitely over leveled. So. All that remains is the massacre. Oh, that's poetic. Wow. Okay. There's no one here to listen to your poetry. God. Uh, I, I think that I was supposed to be here like ages ago. <laughs> because, like, they're talking about it as if it's some massive monstrosity. And uh, it's just like a regular mob. We fought that mob like a hundred times before. And, and like, to be real, uh, it, he's not even much stronger than the regular mob, which is kind of weird. Okay, so citizen's top hat. Let's see what this is like. Can't see anything. The chest is in the way. Anyway, easy boss. Easy life. Extra endurance. Sure, let's wear the top hat. Uh, sure. That's extra stamina it gives me. Let's go for it. I look kind of cool. I'm, I'm really skinny right now. Made me look skinny. Oh, here we go. This chest is locked, but when do I get keys, man? So that was the guy, huh? Transformed beyond recognition. I don't know about all that. Okay, so I can see that's the way we need to go, but I'm going to check everywhere else first. Like this. My dearest Rose, I hope this finds you well. The most alarming reports are going around here. Our comrades are said to have been defeated at several points in the city with little resistance. There's talk of an enemy battalions made of machines that seem to be unstoppable. Still, there's hope. Our officers... Tell me that the Marquis de Lafayette himself has agreed to take command. Only he has not appeared yet. I do not know if we will meet again, my friend. Whatever happens, you must know that... I didn't finish this note, that's what. You must know that I was not going to finish this note anyway. Okay. So. I want more bosses, and I want proper bosses. Hello? This is the second half of the suit that I got, maybe. Hephaestus Battens. Swiftness module. Now that sounds like my kind of module. Okay. Where is it? Oh, moderately increases immobilization generated by dodge and sprint attacks. Cool. That I'll take. I want anything that gives immobilization. So, yeah. Now, 
I wonder. I guess it's only the one way left to go, yeah. We've done here. This is that. Yeah. This is a cutscene again, I think. I beg you, leave this place and seek shelter. I have seen these machines in action. I know all too well their capabilities. I implore you, move now because it's yours. Stop. See you play heed my words. Flee. We must leave this place, Monsignor. There's no time. Huh. Okay. I mean, he tried. A worthy attempt. Fruitless in the end, however. Okay. It's going well. I wonder if I can get a stat point quickly. Look, I'm actually... Yeah, 5k for the next stat point. I'm actually currently looking to upgrade this again, but there's no Orichalcum. So, the second the Orichalcum pops up in the boutique, I will, I will start saving for the next weapon upgrade, because it's a big one. Uh, and until then, we'll just go for stats, I think. That's the plan. Statistic. I want more bosses though. Let it be known that I would like more bosses. Real bosses. But what is that? This seems ridiculous. I, I'm, I'm almost certain I would have seen that item right there. I'll go get it later. Doggies? Shit, 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 shit. Woof. Okay. Little panic is healthy in these kinds of situations. It's how you get results. This is weird. So, I guess we're going down. Oh, we're on the other side here now. Okay, that makes sense. I guess I'm gonna do it. Even though there's a slim chance that I find anything in these barrels, I'll do it. For the off chance that they put a, an item there. So those dodge attacks that I do, that leaping attack basically, uh, that now gives a little bit extra. I knew you were there! Not like I didn't know. Yo, Zevis, what's up, man? Hey. Hello? How's it going? How's the how's the raiding going? Is it on farm yet? Wow, he actually I thought I would win that. That little battle of wills. P7S is the PF killer. Which one was that again? Can you remind me? I did them all. I just don't know, like... And because you're doing it in Party Finder, you obviously have that the whole time, right? This looks like it can break open. The tree... Yeah, dude, it sucks balls. It sucked balls even when I did it. I think that's probably the one that we struggled on the most, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, do I still go to that restaurant? Which one? I don't go to restaurants all that often anymore. We go to a coffee shop most most weekends. We go to a coffee shop with my parents. Uh, but it's nothing special. You mean my sister's restaurant? She doesn't have the restaurant anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, not anymore. She is teaching now. Uh, during COVID, they shut down, my sister. And then for a little while, she didn't do anything. Uh, I think she got a TEFL teaching degree. <clears throat> and then um, they had some drama with her with her partner in the restaurant and then they shut then they shut down and they went their separate ways and the partner reopened the restaurant as her own and my sister got a job teaching but the 
the the I think the the killing blow was probably COVID. The worst thing is that the only difficult part's like thirty percent HP. That's where most people wipe. Oh, but I mean the this the shitty part about that is that you have to wait till thirty percent HP. Like you have to play all the way through there multiple times. Every time, the only way you know if it's gonna go well is until you get when you get to thirty HP. You know, thirty percent. At least if it was right at the start, you'd know right from the beginning if you're wasting your time or not. Why can't kill this guy already? <laughs> oh God! Take the Bible, leave him. Shit, that's grim. Blood splat, go. Blood splat. Ah, oh, he didn't do it, dude. That would have been a good scene. Take this to the clerk's office at the Chatelet. Oh, oh wait, they still got him. Oh, it's protected by another Titan. Then I know exactly how this is going to end. See, same, same as the previous area. There was a guy in a coffin. Same, same, dude. Same, same. What did you miss yesterday? Uh, we killed a bunch of bosses. And we killed a big boss that gave us this cool little dash at, like, not attack. It's a dash attack and also a movement ability. Um, it was a titan. And uh, it, it, I think that I think that there are multiples of them. Because it seems to make sense. Seeing that now we have been shown that the coffin that the dude that we rescued in, like, that coffin is the same as the previous one. Anyway, yeah. I'm not afraid. I am not a member of the royal army. Au contraire, I intend to put an end to it. Kratzel, congrats, man! And now comes the time when the wolves are at each other's throats. May as well restart Eternal when I go back to it. I won't remember anything. Uh. Yeah, I only played one night of Eternal. I might, but depends on when I go back to it. If I keep playing Steel Rising and Temtem, then I might, yeah. Kratzel! Congratulations, dude. Congratulations. That's fantastic. Well done, dude. Well done. I will not hurt you. You can believe me. Believe you? I'm afraid it's too late, madame. Those whose bodies are strewn about this square paid the ultimate price for their blind trust. Like me, they believed in their country. In the National Guard that they were urged to join. They believed in the Marquis de Lafayette who was to lead them to victory. But they waited in vain for their savior. Look at them now. See what has become of their beautiful illusions. My monitor just turned itself on. Give me a sec. I'm moving my Twitch chat back over to where it's meant to be. Here we go. Ah, oh, you guys are back where you should be. All is right in the world once more. Okay. That means I can get distracted by Twitter. And I can uh, have my statistics open. There we go. Fantastic. Now you guys are on this side again. No, I'm not using the frosty fan. So I've I've committed to maining the uh, nemesis claws. Yeah. And they're great. They're great. Uh, they have super high immobilization. Seems to work quite well. How did they die? Steel and fire, madame. We didn't stand a chance. And our wretched commanders must have known it. They saw what that gigantic automat was capable of. Yet they let him cross the bridge and didn't sound the retreat. The only reason I'm still alive is that I'm a spineless coward. I couldn't help myself. My legs carried me here. Where I hid. Motionless. And it was from here that I witnessed the massacre. That creature. A parody of a cardinal. Nothing could stop it. Okay. Soldiers and volunteers alike were mown down like sheaves of wheat. I wonder if they do mean the one I fought, or if it, this is them hyping up the Titan dude that I'm going to fight. The automat. Does it have any weaknesses? I don't know. My comrades attacked the sphere that supported it. In retrospect, they probably should have tried a different strategy. 
They should have aimed higher, perhaps. Its head? If you could call it a head. There's no way of knowing. Why not the Bloodborne type weapon? Uh, you know. I will go and find it. Uh, this one's cool. My prayers go with you. Even if I don't think you stand much of a chance. Wow, thank you, man. Thank you. Wow, that's great. Thank you. Thank you. The vote of confidence. Uh, what is... What is the biggest anime release in many years? What is it? Is it Chainsaw Guy or whatever? Is that the one? What is the, what is the biggest release? Yo, tell me. Chainsaw Man. Okay, that's the one. Wow, look at me knowing things. Bleach! <laughs> that's old news, man. That's old news. Uh, I, I know these things because I follow a few people who are like, uh, you know, anime obsessed. Like, for real, for real. The Thousand Year Arc is finally animated? What? No. I don't know what that means, but that's not what I know, dude. I just, I just see Chainsaw Guy popping up, like, everywhere. Everywhere. Oh, oh, shit, there it is! Oh, it's right there! Oh, my God! Heckin' huge. Hold on, let me just check over the side quickly. The boss is right there, man. It's time for a big boss. This is the one that they hyped up so damn much that it has to be good. I wonder if this is... Is this an animation or is this a note? It's a note. Monsignor, the Marquis is at its worst, and there is every reason to believe that his hours are numbered. Would you be willing to come to uh, Argentul? And administer his last rites, we both know that it's not always been a good Christian, but he fears for his immortal soul and promises to repent. I, his valet, am all that he has left. I pray you will not let him expire in such a terrible isolation. I remain, Monseigneur, your humble servant. Okay. I don't know anything about the Chainsaw Man thing, so I'm just sort of, I'm whatever, man. I'm whatever. I'll watch it, maybe. Maybe, but I have so much other stuff to watch, dude. Okay, let's see if the, re if the real boss is a real boss. Or if this is going to be a, a, a lul. Here we go! Cutscene as well. I look so dapper and so shit at the same time. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Is it going to talk? Is it going to talk? Hello? Oh! <laughs> There's a little priest! Brain, it's got a book. What the hell, man? What is this? Oh shit! Oh god, I'm dead. What the hell, man? Dude, that's crazy. Oh, I see. The ball doesn't really take damage. Yeah. I see now, I see now. Easy done, dude. Easily done. Easily done. If that's the whole boss, then this is... We've got a problem here. It's gonna be too easy. Shit. Oh yeah, here we go, here we go. What are you doing? Oh, he's got blades now! <laughs> How long is this gonna go on for? Oh, I know what to do. Nope, that didn't work. Also didn't... Oh, okay, just had a timer on it. Okay. Gotcha. Dude, you can't even attack him at the top. Like, this is kind of lame. Okay, okay. It's a, it's a patience battle. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just have to, It's a battle of patience. What? This is not a joust! Get away from me, you shit!
Okay, we got it. Again! He's doing it again! No, dude. No, oh, shit, wrong button. No, I'm dead! Dude, how does that get me with these glancing... Like, if you look at the replay on that, I have no doubt that you will see that I was not hit there. No doubt. I have no doubt, dude. He's flaming now. One more like that. Last one, dude. No, shit! No! This is what happens when you drink a potion! I'm, I'm firing, I'm firing, I'm, I'm burning. I'm burning in the fire. Floundering, dude. Here we go. I got him. Yes! No, shit, look at him! Dude, he's so dead! Oh my god. Look, look, look! That, that diamond in the middle? I just need to... He threw his book! I just need to fill it up one time, dude. One time, come. Do the attack. Yes, now another one. No, not this! Oh my god. All that progress that I just made. I was too late. I was too slow. Getting a little, uh, you know, twitchy here. How? One shot, a dude. God. <sighs> yeah. Okay. So it's an easy boss. It's just. It just takes so long, dude. It just takes so long. Dude, I dodged it. Is what I'm saying. Yeah, do it again. It's just a sponge with basic attack. Well, yeah, I mean, I, I agree that the, the fight is not super inspired, and most of the mechanics are just super annoying, like that spinny one. It's just stupid. It's legit just stupid. Because, look, look, you, you can't stagger him. Because if you wait too long, then, then the stagger, the amount of immobilization that you do to him, it just disappears. Look, look. It just disappears, and then you got nothing left. He has to. He has to do it like three times in a row, like that. See? Oh my god! And I missed it because I was out of stamina. I wonder if I can use the gun. Hold on, I didn't even consider using the gun. Oh my god! The gun might work. Uh, no, it's not working. It's not working. I'm trying. It's not working. It's a waste. But it does look like you can use the gun to keep his, his immobilization up. 
So like you shoot once to keep the immobiliz immob immobilization up, and then and then you stop, and then you then you go in for the attacks. Cause look, it's, it's dropping so quickly, man. Oh my god, yo, Reto. See, this is stupid. This is just this is just this is just lame. Maybe there's a way to do it. Maybe I need to charge his head or something. But I don't know if that works, man. I try. Nope. Doesn't do anything, dude. Doesn't do anything. Again, immediately. No! Oh my god, and I go and run out of stamina. I figured it out. You just have to do it very early. Okay, so the annoyance is gone, but it's still a stupid boss. I don't particularly want to waste my um, my last few bullets on this. Okay, here we go. See, he doesn't get staggered after he does that attack, so um, it ends up being more difficult to, like, you know, make it work. But if I, if I, it doesn't matter if I'm burning here, by the way, because if I just have the potion running the whole time, it nullifies the fire entirely. I went too late. Ooh, that was so close. Okay, it's close. I mustn't get hit by the book and then I'm fine. Oh, here it comes. There we go, dude. We are so close to critting him. After this one, I'll have him. He's dead after this. Easy. If I can survive. No! I will survive. I got this. Okay. Oh my god! I'm one attack off! Oh, I got it. There we go. Yes! Okay. Oh, shit. See? Yeah, okay. okay. I have nothing to say about that boss. <laughs> I have nothing to say. That was just annoying. So that's the second titan. It's gonna give us a new ability. Probably the, uh, the grapple hook. It's my guess. I think I've predicted this now. Let's see. And here's the guy. He didn't die. Yo, wake up! Stay back! Remain calm, Monsignor. You are safe now. Mm. What did they do to me? This dream. This nightmare. It's over. This nightmare. What nightmare, Monsignor? It was terrible. I was... A shadow among 
shadows. There was so much anger, despair. How, how long has it been? A day? A year? Fire! There were flames everywhere! And death! This scene doesn't look great. I was forced to inflict. Oh Lord, what have I done? Is this the oh. that awaits our immortal souls? Once our time on this earth has ended, if this is true, then how are we to go on living with nothing to hope for, nothing to believe in? Oh my God, I just figured it out. I understand now. So he was in that chest and his life force was powering the automat the boss that we just fought because this is the this is the the man of god and that automat back there it was throwing the book at us quite literally and it had a little praying dude in the front and it was definitely him so the previous one was being powered by the guy that we found in that coffin and thus ergo we are being powered by someone in a coffin as well it's going to be the daughter of the great inventor Oh my shit! Yes! So, we are an actual human person somewhere in a coffin busy having a nightmare. This is the nightmare! Agus is the nightmare! And this guy was in love with the queen or he, he, he had some obsession with the queen and so he, he put his daughter there to protect the queen. He, this is his daughter. Or his daughter was deathly ill and he wanted to keep her alive. God damn, dude. It makes so much sense now. So we are going to keep going. And then at the end of the game, the final coffin we find is going to be us. We are going to be in that coffin. I love it. If that is the way the story is going, I'm pretty sure anyone at this point would have figured it out. But if that's where the story is going, it's going to be fantastic. It's going to be great. How were you captured, Monseigneur? I was with... Abbe Grégoire. Yeah, yeah. In Place Dauphine. We've gone to speak with the volunteers of the Garde Nationale. We implored them not to take up arms against the King's machines. Alas. Yeah. Spoiler, yes. That's the idea. And we had to leave in, in great haste. After that, oh dear. I can't remember a thing. Those poor people. These automats were truly made in the mold of their master. Ruthless to think for just one simple reproach against the court. The king cast me into hell. Hmm. Okay, what about Abbe Grégoire? Yeah, so, I mean, I, I hope that's the case because that would be an amazing story. But if they choose to go somewhere else with it, I guess it could be okay. I don't know. Man, understanding a story in a game and following the story in a game is the easy part. It's the rest of it that's hard. <laughs> you owe your freedom to Abbe Grégoire. The good abbot, I tell you, this man is utterly irreplaceable. He has devoted himself, body and soul, to the mission I entrusted to him. Investigating the king's entourage. In particular, the man who enabled him to create this ungodly army. Right. But, mon dieu. The notes. What notes, Monseigneur? The notes the abbot placed in my safekeeping. Those heretics took them. Oh. I know where the documents can be found. I must go to the Chatelet prison. Ah. What shall I do? Where will I be safe? Go and join the abbot at the Société des Amis des Noirs. The way is clear for now, but you must go quickly. More automats will be here soon. Ah. Wow, he just like teleported off the screen. The bishop's hook. I knew it. Now equipped with the bishop's hook. With this tool, she can grapple up previously unreachable heights. It requires endurance to be used. V when a grapple point's in range. 